In this video we'll look at the double backs inner panel feature as it's not used quite as often as some of the other inner panel features it's not available on the quick design toolbar to apply a double back click on the volume and then either go to the modify menu add double backs here or just right click to access the mouse menu and click on add double backs here there are four types of double backs. These first two are linked to different types of properties, hardware and materials and other assembly details. The third one is a double back that uses a nil panel. And finally, double back for raw doesn't have any properties associated with it at all. So it's a blank canvas for you to use. A double back is an extra panel that you can put in parallel to the back of a cabinet. If you're only adding one, you can position it proportionally to the front and back or you can set a specific distance from the front or the back. If you add more than one you can only have them placed evenly throughout the volume you're working in. Normally you would just put one double back in so let's just put one in here and let's put it exactly halfway from the front and the back. An example of when you might use this is if you were designing a kitchen island and you want to have two facades. I'm going to click outside the cabinet and take the back panel away. So now it's open front and back. Now we've got our double back in, we've got the volume split into two. For the front volume, I'm going to right click and add a door, double door built in, and I'm going to do the same for the volume at the back. So we've used a double back here to create a nice partition in the right place for a kitchen island. Let's have a quick look in 3D view. And let's select wireframe and open the doors. So there you have it, the double back feature. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.